Appalachian Wireless has some of the best data rates in wireless on our plans, and not to mention an amazing deal on one of our hottest smartphones. But that's all the time I have to explain. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. The streets of Pikeville are quiet Saturday morning just hours before the start of the final day of Hillbilly Days. But vendors set up for the festival are already hard at work. The hours between 6 and 10 in the morning are valuable prep times for the food vendors as they get ready for the day's sales to the Hillbilly Days crowd. It usually takes us about an hour to, to get everything ready. Uh, so we got to get everything cooked ahead so that we can get fired off in the, in the morning when the rush hits us. We use a sourdough starter, so that's going to take a little bit to set up, a little bit to, to get it going. So by 7.15 to 7.30, we were mixing our first batch to have it ready by 8 o'clock. Without that prep time, the Hillbilly Days fun could be a bust. Well, it's really important for us so we can get prepared for the uh, rush that normally we'll have. You know, it starts about 10 o'clock or we're going to get busy. And uh, so it's really important for us to get in here early in the morning and get, get ready to go. But even with the empty streets, one vendor was already hard at work just after 8 a.m. Auntie Ruth's Donuts, set up on Hambly Boulevard, already had a long line some 90 minutes before booths were scheduled to open for the day. Whenever, if they know we open at 8, they're here before 8 o'clock. Okay. They're always waiting before we open. There's only so much prep work you can do beforehand, uh, but I got here about 6 this morning. That makes early morning prep time all the more valuable for the donut vendor. We like to think we have a good product, and I think we do. Uh, and the customers think so as well. But it's just, it's just one of those things you do the best you can. I just thank these wonderful folks up here for making it a good event. It's, it's a lot more than just our booth that makes it an event. It's all the people involved. It's very good. With Hillbilly Days nearly a wrap, the food vendors ensured that those who braved Saturday's rainy weather left Pikeville with their bellies full. From Hillbilly Days, Chris Anderson, EKB News.